ناظرین السلام علیکم لیگل نالج کے سیگمنٹ میں محمد عالم آپ کے ساتھ حاضر ہے آج کے سیگمنٹ میں وی ول ٹاک اباؤٹ سوشل میڈیا ایکٹیویٹیز کین جیپرڈائز یور کلیم جی ہاں ناظرین سوشل میڈیا جیسے کہ ہم دیکھتے ہیں ہر آدمی کی کسی حد تک ضرورت بن چکی ہے سم پیپل آر یوزنگ سوشل میڈیا ریسپانسبلی اینڈ دے آر سم آف اس ہو ڈو ناٹ یوز ریسپانسبلٹی اینڈ وی پٹ many many things and many many are personal information out to the public which is absolutely not necessary so it is more important ke jahan pe agar aapka koi claim koi lawsuit uh, chal raha ho chahe kisi hawale se even personal injury ke hawale se ya koi aur social civil lawsuit aapka chal raha ho um, us tamam surton mein uh, when you are putting up information on social media uh, you should You should understand that that information is available to your opponent. That information can be used against you. And I'll give you example in a personal injury case. When somebody is involved in an accident after a few years, they have developed some emotional and psychological issues. You're seeing your doctors, um, you know, taking medication, you're depressed, you're unable to work. Um, while all these informations Obviously, you and your family know that you are suffering. Your doctors know and they are prescribing you medication. But remember this, your opponent, uh, the entity that you are suing, the entity that you have a claim against, are not looking for those information. They are looking for information in social media. They are trying to find you, you know, on social media. If you post your picture uh, that you are attending a party, or a birthday, um, you're not even realizing that just posting a birthday party um, um, and pictures and activities may jeopardize uh, your claim uh, because defense counsels for insurance companies lawyer, they have evidence and, and many times, you know, your evidence and your statement to insurance companies or other parties that you are not enjoying your life, um, you know, you are not social. Um, because you are giving all these statements in a broader sense that you are not enjoying your life and you are not social because you do not attend many parties that you used to attend uh, and your statement while may be correct insurance companies and their lawyer if they find your social media account and if they find your pictures that you attended a birthday party they may discredit your information um, they may discredit in a court hearing Um, you know, your, they may bring your credibility uh, to a caution that you have lied when you have given a statement that you are not social. In fact, here's, here are the pictures that you are social and you have attended XYZ birthday party on XY date. Um, and it's very unfortunate, but this is what the facts of life and this is what, what the facts in litigation um, that your opponent party will try to minimize your claim, will try to bring your credibility into questions and with those pictures, they will do that. They will put up those pictures in front of jury, they will read your statement um, and after reading your statement, they will put these pictures and ask jury if they believe this person and you never know. There are members of the jury who, um, you know, uh, look at your statement and look at the picture and may even not believe you and once they do not believe you, They may not believe you for many other things. And remember, insurance companies and their lawyers, they look at social media's account these days for every claimant. They will try to find uh, information about you. So you have to be very careful when you, what you post. Um, these lawyers and your opponent, they will not post pictures. So you may have posted posted pictures on online when you are sad, when you are not happy. They will not bring those pictures into the court's attention, but they will bring pictures uh, or comments that you have made or your, your social media friends may have commented about you. And if those comments may help their case, they will use those comments. So you have to be very careful when you make a claim, either as a result of car accident, as a result of slip and fall injuries. You may have a long-term and short-term disability claim. Insurance companies are out there. Their adjusters, their lawyers 
our hunt for information. And these days, you know, they don't have to even do an extensive surveillance um, because most of the people put their information out on social media and they will find this information and they, that may jeopardize your claim. So remember, even if you have a claim, you have to be very, very careful what you put out there. And in fact, even if you don't have a claim, you must ensure that you only put relevant information, not too personal information. You know, we have, um, um, we have heard and we, we know there are incidents when you are, you know, writing information about your traveling on social media. This is not a good idea to put this information. And when you come back, you know, either there, you may find a break and enter because there are thieves. There are people who with bad intention, if they found that you, the entire family is on traveling for a month um, to Europe, you know, they have a lot of time to break and enter and, you know, take away your stuff. So be responsible. And if you have any claim, uh, if you have any questions about your claim, uh, about your injuries, uh, feel free to talk to us. We are lawyers for personal injury cases. And we can advise you, we can guide you, and we have a 24-7 emergency hotline where you can get a benefit of a lawyer who can give you free advice. And that 24-7 emergency hotline is 416-625-2636. Again, 416-625-2636. Thank you for listening.